The Colorado Center for the Blind. Take charge with confidence and self-reliance. Mom. Thank you. Mom. <laughs> I do want to share something with you. Jackson was born and he was classified as blind uh, from the moment he was born. But he always was able to see a little bit and started having multiple problems. And he uh, gave us fits because he, he didn't want to use a cane. So he was running into anything and everything <laughs> to the point that the school was calling me saying, Ms. Schwobel, we've really got to do something. His um, vision A teacher and I both said, we've got to get him comfortable with who he is. And through uh, the National Federation for the Blind, he actually got a lot of support. I did as well. We both became, I think, a lot more educated. So um, I want to thank y'all for being so good to my baby and taking such good care of him. And I'm extremely, extremely proud of him. And he is a Southern gentleman, just so that y'all know. <laughs> be a, a great experience for you. I thought it would really stretch you and really uh, force you to own your blindness. But obviously as a parent sitting here listening to everyone um, talk ab about your qualities um, is tremendously um, uh, fantastic for me as a mother. But um, hearing Hearing you talk about the pride that you got from your projects that you did in helping other people, um, those are the qualities that, as a parent, I'm so incredibly proud that you um, value helping other people. And um, I had no idea that you would have made this kind of an impact the outcome from this program, yeah, yeah, it's just so gratifying as a parent to see your kid that you were once so concerned about, you know, after being diagnosed, that what's, what's their life, what, what, you know, what, what, what's in store for them, what, what are they going to be able to take away, and uh, well, I'm so proud of you, I love you. <laughs> Julia. Oh, oh boy. Here come the tears. <laughs> the things that she can do now, all her accomplishments, I'm, I'm in a good place. I've been had Brittany ever since she was six months old as my baby. And my prayers have been that she could be able to physically <coughs> take care of herself, be independent, and be able to live on her own. CCB, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. If I don't see another day, I know she can take care of herself. And that's the best wish any mother could have for their child. Is to know that they can take care of themselves when I'm not there anymore. Thank you, CCB, for all you've done and all you've taught her. To learn more about the Colorado Center for the Blind, visit our website at www.cocenter.org or call 303-778-1130.